My brother-in-law said we were going. <laughs> and we are here with my niece. Yeah. It's uh, just kind of a ritual. Well, I think it has a wonderful atmosphere. And there's a lovely, relaxing feel about it. And people bring their dogs and their bicycles and <laughs> all their accoutrements. I feel that it's uh, easy going and uh, quite a nice way to start off um, a Saturday morning. I think it's a great opportunity for people to just be able to get fresh. Um, again, everybody's been picking since six o'clock this morning and it helps helps our environment by able to by being able to just, you know, drive three miles from the orchards to get the produce here. It's important to understand, you know, who it comes from, where it comes from, how it was raised, and you really can't do that in a grocery store. Uh, the food tastes better. It's by yeah. local, and you know that food's uh, been grown locally, and there haven't been additional pesticides added, and it hasn't taken up fossil fuel to transport it a thousand miles or whatever, just to know it's grown locally, and that by buying this produce, we're also supporting our local farmers and helping our bodies be, be healthier. I mean, what could be better than that? It's definitely important to us to like be a face in the community and you know like we sell to restaurants and we have our CSA but it's definitely the most rewarding for our business um, to be here and interact with people and I mean we really enjoy doing the markets. Well it tends to usually be a sunny day. I run into my friends. I make a lot of con business connections here with the farmers market as well, so it carries over to other aspects of the business, the landscaping part of it. Oh, I love uh, all the the botanicals. That's what hit me first. I love arranging my flowers and getting a variety, which I find that they're quite reasonable here too. I'll buy eggplants to make eggplant parmesan. Sometimes I'll get uh, my seedlings here to put in my own garden. I think it's just being outdoors for one and uh, growing and um, selling. That's, that's all great, great aspects of the business. Well, my grandfather actually owned the farm. He came over from Czechoslovakia. And so his children worked on the farm. My dad, aunts, uncles. Join me. Yes, <laughs> your mom. They uh, worked on the farm and then over the years, the farm has changed Thank hands. You. Now my brother is the owner of the farm, so he's continued on maintaining the peach orchards and the, you know establishing berry patches, and so that's what's continued. Mika sign says established 1923. And that was our farm when that was established. I tend to go every Saturday. We love it. 